Hey everybody, welcome to Vlogmas Day 3. So, I thought I'd actually start my intro looking a little bit more presentable, but this is what you're gonna get, I'm really sorry. So, we've just got, I'm literally alternating and rotating all my jumpers because I sound like the girl from Mean Girls, but that's all that fits me right now in my wardrobe. So, um, yeah, it's currently 10 past two. I'm waiting for a delivery. I'm waiting for Ollie's, um, one of Ollie's Christmas presents to be delivered. Um, and the slot that I have is 1.36 to 2.36. I've got about 20 more minutes. So um, I've just edited a video, my Vlogmas day one and two, that's gonna go up tonight. So obviously that, I'll link it here, but you've probably already seen it. Um, and yeah, not much else you can see. And my little penny poppers down there. She's wide awake and she's giving mummy lots of smiles, aren't you? She's got the cutest bow on. I'll link the shop where I get her bows from. Um, I know I've linked some shops before in the past, but what I wanted is I just wanted some more dainty looking bows because she doesn't have any, well, much hair at the moment. It's very fair, isn't it? Yeah. I just found the bigger ones looked a bit too um, big on her head at the moment. They'll look a bit better when she grows into them. But yeah, let me um, see if she'll smile for you. Penny, can you say happy Vlogmas, everybody? <laughs> can you say happy Vlogmas, everybody? Look at these chubby cheekies. Look at these chubby cheekies. Yeah. Are you happy, girls? Are you a happy girl? you just chilling, aren't you, with Mummy? Yeah. So yeah, this one has got like a velvet um, cream bow and then it's like a dusky pink. And then I've just put this bib on because um, it's all that I had down here. I didn't have a muslin cloth when she had her bottle, um, but she's just got a little H&M. Oh, I'm so sorry, darling. I'm showing your outfit of the day. Yeah. Mummy showing your outfit of the day. Yes, she is. So it's just some leggings. Um, and she's got some look how cute her socks on. And just the wrap over vest that goes with it. So yeah. I'm um, actually she's just um she's currently just gone into naught to three. Um so her first size bits and pieces don't fit you anymore, do they? No. So I'm gonna pop them on um my pre-loved page. So if you want to have a little look, I'll link it's always linked in the description bar. Um and I've actually found a huge stash of Darcy's Jojo Siwa bows that she doesn't wear anymore. So I'm gonna put those on my Instagram as well. Because I think by the time you've got enough hair to fit them, they'll probably be something else in fashion, won't there? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, other than that. I've not done much else today, to be honest. I'll tell you what I have done, if you can see. I've started opening my Black Friday H&M order, and to be honest, this sounds so awful, but I don't even know what I've ordered. There's a jumper here that's got glitter flecks in it. Why? I don't like it. I've not even opened it, and I don't. I know I don't like it. So yeah, at some point I need to um, go through that and see. We'll probably end up sending it all back, won't we? Yes, we will. Yes, we will. But yeah, I think I'm going to have to take Darcy to ballet today. And the last time I took her to... Well, I didn't take her. I was in the car with Tom. But the last time I actually drove to her ballet was um, when Penny was first out of hospital. I think that first Sunday. And I absolutely... I just remember I was struggling, sat in the car because I was in so much pain. Um, but yeah, Tom's basically um, working late tonight. So I need to take Darcy to ballet. So I have to take Ollie as well. And maybe we can call in Tesco and get some bits and pieces for tea. But yeah, I just wanted to come on and share my face. Um, I'm not sure what else I'll show. Um, the elf today wrote both the kids a note and delivered a Santa can because Ollie's not been... He's been a little bit naughty the past couple of days. So we've had to um, just remind him of his behaviour. So nothing very exciting on the elf, elf front. But I'm not going to speak about it just yet, but we've got such an amazing day tomorrow. I'm so excited. So I'll explain a bit later and maybe I'll set it all up with you. Because um, we're going to do like a little something from the elf, which ties into tomorrow. So yeah, I'm really excited about that. And I will vlog all of that. So I don't know if I'll include that in this vlog. Or whether I'll do like that on its own. We'll see. Because I don't think I'm going to get very much footage today. 
also at some point I am going to take you outside because um, as you know we've done, well you might not know if you've not seen any of my videos, but obviously we've been doing so much reno work to the house um, and we've finally been getting to grips with the outside um, and Tom painted like the top of our little coping stings black and it rained last night and the paint wasn't dry so now it looks like I've got a zebra wall like actually um he's also started doing our canopy i should have filmed like parts of the process um maybe i'll take you out there in a second i'm just gonna wait for this delivery to come in case i'm literally still on my doorstep talking to my camera people might think i'm a bit odd um but yeah let me wait for that delivery and then i'll take you outside and i'll show you what my wreath looks like on the front door because it looks amazing <laughs> Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and day? Hey everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. As you can see we're in the car because we're going to Capella because our nice elf called Ernie has booked us to go on the Polar Express. The Polar Express? Yes, yeah, so we're off to the Polar Express. Um, I love Polar Express film. That is your favourite film, isn't it, Ollie? Yeah. I'm just trying to see if I can tell you whereabouts it is where we're going. Oh, it might sell my paperwork actually. So we are going to Ashburton in Devon. Money. So we're almost there actually. Um, Tom just needed to stop to go to the toilet, so we're in the services. Yes, Ollie? Yeah, I will. Yeah, so um, I'll try and vlog when we're on the train. Um, but yeah, we that's why I haven't been on this morning, because we haven't done anything. We went food shopping this morning just to make sure we've got everything. And we've got um, a charity Santa Dash run. Tomorrow I will not be running. I will be walking, because I, don't, I haven't even been signed off to work out yet. So... Um, Yes, Ollie. I need you to close your eyes. I'm gonna say if your eyes. I need you to open. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can I open them? No. <laughs> Ollie, Penny can't have that now. No, listen, listen. Penny and I can't have that because you've had it in your mouth. <laughs> that was silly. Um, yeah, so we're all in, as you can probably see, matching pyjamas. Tom was refusing to wear them, but he's he's actually got them on. So um, I'll try and insert a picture here of, I did a little family photo before we left. So the only person who doesn't have them is Penny, because they only went from nine months, and obviously she's only not to three. So she's got a little baby girl one from Asda that says my first Christmas. So she's still in the festive spirit. Um, <laughs> But yeah, it's actually raining really heavy, um, so I'm hoping it stops um, because I think from what I've read we have to get a transfer bus from the car park to the station. Yeah, so um, the elf left them our Polar Express tickets. So yeah, it's exciting. Did you get any funny looks in your pyjamas? Yeah, a few people looked at me and died. Did, <laughs> did they look at you weird? Like, oh my god, what are they doing? Uh -uh. Right, off to the train. For old lang syne, my dear. For old lang syne, we'll talk a cup.
very funny. But our lyrics are so scary Christmas. You know what that is? That's a gallop voice. Um, it's about quarter past eight. Tom has just gone to get our Indian. We're having takeaway tonight. Um, Darcy's actually gone to bed. She said she wasn't feeling very well, but I think she was just overtired and overexcited. And I've just gone to check her, and she's like out for the count. And Ollie is just having some time on his iPad before he goes to bed. Um, we had such an amazing experience. Um, it was so magical and just to see i was getting like choked up seeing like darcy and ollie and like ollie especially I was like wow especially when santa came in um so yeah can you see penny she's literally just staring at the christmas tree she was good as gold bless her like honestly i've been blessed with such an amazing baby but i thought i would open um day three and day four of my glossy box advent calendar and see what goodies we got before I end this vlog. Oh, all of these are in the bottom ones. I'm searching the top drawer, so I've got four. Where's three? Ah, oh, there we go, in the same drawer. Right, so, yes, if you've never done the Polar Express, um, obviously it's sold out for this year, but I highly recommend booking it. I think they go on sale in like August, I think, or beginning of September. Highly recommend it. Um, I know they do quite a few, um, areas up and down the country but yeah amazing just amazing experience um right so number three smaller box as you can see oh, i've got it upside down oh i think this is the one darcy was excited for so it's a satin sleep mask that's really cool and then number four is a bigger box is this my facelift tool i think this is my facelift tool that i was excited about yes it is yes it is how i've like resisted getting this out because they sent me this back in november i was kindly gifted this like the first thing i've ever been like really gifted and i'm like chuffed i'm so chuffed um sarah chapman london Genesis the facelift so it's like a facelift tool and then i need to read all the instructions on the back so i can give myself a bit of a lift you know you know, we are aging over here, so I need to get back on the whole skin care routine. But let me just go and grab um, what we got, actually, from the Polar Express, and I'll show you because it's super cute. We actually had premium tickets, um, not for any reason, not being bougie or anything like that. That's all that was left. Um, I actually booked these tickets at the start of October, I think, um, and we tried to go last year but it got cancelled because of covid um and a few people on my instagram have said if you manage to do it try and do the twilight one which is like when it's just getting dark so the only one i could get because i didn't want to do midweek because it would mean like tom taking time off of work um so i managed to get like obviously saturday obviously it's quite early in december but it doesn't matter it's obviously december and we did the 415 one but the only tickets they had left were premium and i think the only difference is because obviously i walked all along carriages and the carriages look exactly the same the only difference was the gift that you get um so you get like a mug with the premium and you don't with the standard seat so i mean it isn't I don't know, I think they're about 10 or 12 pound extra. I mean, the cups are lovely. So we each got one of these. So, I mean, it's not just like one of the, it's very, can you see it's got all the like detail there and it says the Polar Express Believe. Can you see that there? And then on the back. So it is a lovely mug. Um, 
but yeah it's not obviously it's not necessary this is what you get in the extra and then you all depend it doesn't matter what seats you're in you all get a bell which says the polar express and it's a really lovely bell actually it's really great quality it's not like a flimsy belt it's really sturdy it's heavy weighty and then the kids all got um well not the kids we all had a golden ticket um oh, i don't know where it is i'll try and insert a picture here because i know tom took a picture of what they did at the end is they stamped like the conductor does on the film he does the little punching of the names and he punched our initials into everyone's ticket so i think tom took a picture so i'll insert that here to show you um, but yeah we kept all of that obviously uh, and yeah it was just amazing like absolutely amazing it took us about an hour and a half each way to get there so a little bit of a trek car wise but i mean it was amazing well worth it i'd 100 percent do it again so yeah highly highly recommend um, and yeah really really feeling festive now the twinkling lights going in the background that's your free entertainment, isn't it, darling? And then tomorrow, um, we're doing a charity Santa Dash, like a 5K, but I absolutely am not running, so I'm going to be walking. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end Vlogmas Day 3 and 4 here, and then I'll keep recording from tomorrow. Um, and I promise, I know I didn't, I know I said I was going to show you, but I want to show you the updates that we've done to the outside of the house, like the canopy. Um, I don't know if I've got, I might have pictures, so I'll talk about that in the next vlog but yeah tom's been working his little socks off bless him to transform the outside of our house so i will show you that in tomorrow's vlog because after we get back from the santa dash we're staying home then so i will have time um but yeah i really hope you enjoyed today's vlog don't forget to give it a thumbs up it really helps support my channel um leave me a comment down below and if you're not already i hope you'll consider hitting the subscribe button and joining us here on youtube and I will see you in my next video. Bye, everyone. Should all the quaint